Three. The Femme Fatales. Funny story, we played, uh, me and Thars played Wink and Arcana, mm -hmm. and they were Zelda uh, ZSS, and the next team we played after that was Zelda ZSS. And we're like, oh, well, that's cool. Oh, really? Yeah. A completely different team, but it was still Yeah, Z I think it was uh, Dante and Ezra. Huh, okay. Not really sure what happened I mean, to Ezra. Dante, uh, dang. Ezra signed up for singles, but then didn't report to either of his matches. He just, like, disappeared. Oh, okay. Weird. Because I remember seeing him like maybe a half hour prior to singles and then nothing. I'm still pissed at myself for not winning that Ivysaur versus Roy. <laughs> <sighs> did you see that? I did not. Things I got were not a, good. I got a up air sweet spot, up air sweet spot to solar beam combo. Oh, that's it was, like it was beautiful. That's nice. As always, we got Matt Mosley over there playing some Hotline Miami, going for those combos. He plays it like every week. Oh yeah, that's a fantastic game. That's why. And he's great at it too. He's good. Ooh, already at that 13 combo. 16 combo. Tearing it up already in the second area. So how do you get combos in that? Uh, so it's just constantly killing, and if you go too long without killing an enemy, then the combo will reset. Uh. Oh, already into the next area. Wow. Crazy I think, cool. I think he's done it before. <laughs> I think he has gotten the highest combo really. Alright, here we go, going to Delfino's Secret. Uh, both of these characters like to run around a lot on big stages, so it doesn't surprise me that they came here. Zelda's up B's finally fixed, which makes me happy that I might have to play her again. Her up B's finally fixed? Yeah, because if you did it, it on the wall, it like, would stop on the wall instead of sliding oh. into the ledge. Weird. Yeah, and it was really annoying. Wow, 10 percent on her first time. Already a kill on weeks. Come on, weeks. There we go. I really don't know how this matchup is, because I haven't... Yeah, I don't know. Um, a lot of ZSS's moves are just, like, good frame data-wise. They're fast. And so maybe Zelda has a hard time once they get in close. Yeah. It kind of seems what it is for Wink right now, is he's having a trouble. He's having a lot of trouble getting in. You have to use your uh, Dim's Fire very well. You have, to, uh -huh. you have to zone her out. And so far, I haven't seen him put out one. Like, I don't know why. And, and down smash, smash. That's smash. <laughs> yeah. uh. The uh, Arcana special. Maybe we're gonna see a character change after this because this is looking yeah, pretty might, rough for Wing. Might go to Game and Watch. Game and Watch, yeah, I was thinking that too. He's been pulling out the the yellow Game and Watch. Everyone's got a pocket watch. Heck, laugh. Pocket watch. <laughs> no, <I'm, laughs> I was thinking about it and I was like, uh, I shouldn't have given him the light of day with this. <laughs> Probably gonna get healed. Oh, he's just gonna be patient and wait it out. Yes. Very smart from Wing. I kind of likes to do that, so he's gonna have to start mixing it up, or else he's gonna get punished like that. Mm -hmm. Ooh. That was a nice SDI out of that up smash. Mm -hmm. If he didn't SDI out of that, probably would have gotten up smash like four or five more times. Because <laughs> you know Zelda. Yep, Zelda things. There's finally a Din's fire out on the stage. I know, that was but cool to see. Do anything. I don't I don't get why he's not putting him out. Maybe he just doesn't like them. I don't know. It's a great zoning tool though, so I don't Yeah, I don't get it. There's another one. There's there's a good one. That was a good location. Uh but then he wasn't able to he forced Ar Arcana to go high, but then he wasn't able to cover the high recovery. So that was unfortunate. Ooh, six sweet spot from way out there. That was nice. I don't really 
really see any up tilts from Zelda either. That's a nice forward air. Mm -hmm. Kills at 105, that's just so crazy. This is such a big stage too, like the blast zones are ginormous and it just still kills so early. Oh, oh we've got chain grabs. It's not actually a chain grab, it's the eye defender. Her down throw. Oh, okay. Oh, no, no. give him the heals and just like that, Wink has brought game one back super close. And then Arcana just starts doing some Let's Arcana run. things. Romance and Ace! Romance and Ace, I've been the one! Yeah, kind of just trying to zone each other out right now. No one really wants to get caught by any big combos. I mean, Zero Suit can easily get the Dintire out of there, but it's something else that she's not doing attacking yeah. Zelda, so... And Wing is very good with the, uh, the air dodges. He plays them very well where he won't get punished for them. Mm -hmm. Zelda living go? up to no. 164. 34. Or 134. Why did I say 164? There we go. But F Smash was that? Yep. Alright, F Smash takes it. Alright, game two. Uh, yeah, the character swap isn't looking as necessary this time. He definitely was able to start playing m much more solid and bring that back. We'll see, though. He might pull him out for the lulls. Maybe we'll get Gaming Watch dittos from these guys again. Maybe. The first time I thought I saw that last week, I was like, oh, they're just messing with each other. And then right. I realized it was tournament. Like, oh, <laughs> okay. I feel like if he goes WarioWare, it's Zelda. FOD, he might go, he might go Game & Watch. He's thinking about it. Oh, it is. looks like it's the FOD pick. Mm -hmm. Alrighty, here we go. A lot of sight to us. Either one. Wow, nasty combo coming out from ZSS already. 56% built up. Surprised that didn't actually kill. The signature backwards that, that crawl off from Arcana. <laughs> this is looking like it started like the last game. Mm -hmm. Arcana with the first commanding lead. There's a, there's a forward tilt. Uh, All right, start starts having some teleport chains. Pretty hard to punish that, so maybe we should start going for that more often. But geez, these combos from ZSS. The thing is that every time ZSS is getting her damage off, it's in these big combos that yeah, are going it's forever. Like 30% at least exactly. Whereas Wink's just kind of getting these these hits every now and then. They're slowly building up, and so that's why Arcana is able to build such fast lead. And wow, just another F smash stand still catches Wink. Hate yeah, it's an odd character so to have hard. to deal with. It was pretty cool that they uh, they nerfed being able to side B though every time you got hit. Yeah. That was nice. Ooh, up smash. Sweet spot back there, that was nice. Uh, 
Wow. Once again, Wink recovering from a very big deficit, just like he did game one. He is up, or he is a uh, high percentage on that second stock. Mm -hmm. Kill. Bad move! Well, I have to play Manic Cannon if I can. Ooh, forwarder can take it. Alright, well, Bad Wolf hopping off stream again. Hopefully, I can beat him this week. Zelda giving Zero Suit Samus the heals. Ooh, going for a triple down air. All right, here we go. Last stock. This is uh, Wink playing for his um, winner side of bracket stock right now, trying to force a game three. Ooh, wow! Great stun gun. I'm surprised that Arcana didn't choose to follow that up with a forward smash. But he finds the back air, and that's going to take the last stock. And the handshake comes out. The winner is Zero Suit Samus.